This is my new 75 inch Samsung Q7F TV. It's a QLED TV. It's a Q7F model. I got this thing for a really good deal at Best Buy. I absolutely love this store. This is a $2,800 TV. I got it on sale for $900. This TV is absolutely amazing. I love it. <laughs> you have tons of apps. This is just some of them. <coughs> you got the Spectrum TV app. You got the TV Plus, Netflix, Prime Video, Hulu, Jet TV Now, uh, Google Play, Movies and TV, Voodoo, Movies and TV, um, YouTube, Smart Fades, uh, Gallery. This is the internet web browser. This is the uh, fan dig go now. That's to turn on, or that's to switch over to my PS4. Um, oops, which just turned itself on. Um, the TV, when you turn the TV on and um, it notices the PS4 is not on, it'll turn it on for you. <laughs> it thinks I'm trying to play my PS4. I'm going to shut it off. It's it, it turns your PS4 on for you automatically, which is really nice. Um, <coughs> this TV is amazing. I have never seen a TV this nice before. Well, I mean, other than the really huge TVs at Best Buy, like the 85-inch top-of-the-line Q9F. That was, like, the nicest I've ever seen. Oh, no, I don't want to go to the App Store. <laughs> so, um, this is the apps that that I also have downloaded, and some of the other ones that it comes with. Pandora, Spotify, CNN. I'm going to be doing that one off. <laughs> ABC. ESPN, DIY Network, I mean, you just look at this, I mean, this is just, this is all the apps that come with the TV, but there's more you can get, I mean, there's tons more, this is amazing, <laughs> this is all the other ones you can download, some of these are already installed, um, that do come with your TV, I mean, seriously, there is a lot here, this TV's huge, I mean, 75 inch, I don't even need a TV this big. Um, I never thought I would have a TV this big. Um, before I had a 65 inch, and that was bigger than I ever thought I was gonna have. Um, in my personal opinion, I always thought you'd never need a TV any bigger than 55 inch for your bedroom. Um, but my high sense, I had an H9 Plus um, high sense, which was top of the line for the high sense. Um, it was sadly had problems. Um, after using it for one hour, the screen would blur, and it would get, like, very blurry. After two hours, the screen would dim, and then it would shut off. Um, I guess the LED panel was going, and so they, what they did is, um, they let me swap that TV out for this one, because, um, that TV was a $1,200 TV, and this TV was on sale for $900, so they let me swap it out. I mean... I could not believe this TV was on sale for nine hundred dollars. When I went here, I was like, "Oh my god!" Oh, I saw the apps already have. Um, because this is a twenty eight hundred dollar TV. Like literally, this is a, the the QLED series. This is top of the line. This is the uh, Q seven F model. Anyone that knows Samsung and anyone that knows the QLED TVs, they know they're not cheap. And they know the Q seven F TV is not cheap. And anyone with common sense would know a 75-inch TV is not going to be cheap. Neither. Um, don't care what brand it is. <laughs> um, just to see this thing on sale for $900, I was shocked. I was like, wow, this is a really good deal. You're saving over $1,000 right here. <laughs> it was over $1,200 you were saving, actually. This is all the music and radio apps you can get. Um, this is apps to kill time. I mean, there are so many apps you can get on this TV. It's unbelievable. I cannot wait to dive into this TV and see what you can do. I am blown away. <coughs> I'm serious. There is just so much here. Is it? Where's the, is that the Weather Channel? It's got to be. Um, there is just so much here. I mean, I'm just amazed at um all the stuff you can do with this TV. It's beautiful. <laughs> Let's go back. Yes, smart life. This is all your smart apps, like smart things right here. This helps connect to your phone. I think. Um, God, they just—they got so much you could do on this TV. It's unbelievable. I've <laughs> just look at all these apps. Oh my God. 
this video apps. This TV is amazing. Like all this, this is all the stuff you could do on it. Like wow. This is all your sports apps right here. ESPN, all that NFL Sunday ticket. This is all your games right here. They kind of look like garbage. Some of them do. I mean, some of them aren't bad. You gotta understand, this is not an Android phone. It's not gonna have good games on it. And some of these don't look bad. It's a TV, you know. But this is really amazing. I'm absolutely just blown away. Um, yes, let's exit. <coughs> My PS4 is turning itself back on again. I'm just gonna ignore it. Um, so let's go on Netflix because Hulu don't have any 4K movies, unfortunately. Um, let's go on Netflix and um, I think this movie is in 4K. I think. Yeah, this is one of the 4K movies, Guardians of Galaxies, Volume 2. I hope I don't get um, copyright infringement, but um, just look at this picture. It's unbelievable, and this thing has really good sound, too. I don't want to turn up too loud. Um, it's early in the morning. But this thing has really good sound. This is only on 16. Wow. You need to kill the bass. <laughs> I'm going to turn it down, so... TV's amazing. Beautiful picture. I've never seen um, QLED for this song before. The colors really pop on the TV. <coughs> what an amazing TV. So, this is in 4K. Wow, oh my god. You guys can't tell by my camera, but wow, this is beautiful. I gotta turn it down more. Oh my god, this TV's loud. <laughs> What a loud TV. I love it. I don't know why it looks like shit on the camera. Which is strange because I had the camera set to record in 1080p. It looks amazing on the TV though. Like really clear. God damn, this picture is really nice. This picture is amazing on here. Very nice. So yeah, that's the that's the TV. Great sound, amazing picture. Um, it's really nice. Let's go over to my PS4. <sighs> it does this all the time. Stupid hard drive. <laughs> I should have bought a. Uh, I can't forget any of it right now. I should have bought the other hard drive, not this one. <coughs> Don't ever get a Seagate hard drive. They're garbage. They constantly need repairing. Um, I can't think of what the other brand is right now, but I should have got it instead. So, um, unfortunately, my I don't have a PS4 Pro, so it's not in 4K. And, unfortunately, I can't turn on HDR mode. Because I had the PlayStation VR hooked up to it. But if I could turn on HDR mode, it would be even nicer. The screen kind of looks dim. Something's that way. Let me see. Let me go into settings. It's only for the PlayStation 4. I don't know why. Like, the TV itself was very bright a minute ago. Uh, let me see. Oh, brightness, is, brightness is pretty bright. Backlight's pretty bright. Oh, that's why. Yeah, that's gonna get turned up. That's gonna get turned all the way up. Alright, let's back right up. Get that there. Contrast, pretty good. That's good. Um, colors way down. I want that up more. Turn it up to like 38 so it pops. So, we'll go damn it. That's why. Let me see here. Hmm, doesn't really make a difference. Alright. There you go, that's what the problem was. The uh, contrast enhancer was way down. Okay, there you go. That's what I want. Yeah. Beautiful. Alright. See? The brightness on this, or excuse me, the backlight, I think. I don't know if you can see that. You really can't. There you go. 
the uh, back light is set to 50 all the way up. Um, the, the brightness is set to 2. Contrast set to 35. I think that's pretty good. Let me see. Eh, maybe 30. Maybe 38. No, no. 35 is perfect. Um, sharpness is set to 16. Color is set to 38. And I think that looks really good. Um, tint set to 0. Local damage is on high. Um, contest enhancer is on high. Do not turn HDR mode on. It looks like shit. Oh, it can't because the PS4 won't let me. But yeah, it looks really terrible. So, um, I don't know. I mean, it's pretty good. For some reason, the uh, settings got changed. I don't know why. Oh, this one. So, yeah. No, why is this? This one's just not available. Okay. Um, yeah. Alright. That's a lot better. <coughs> um, I can't really play the game, unfortunately. But, um, you guys can see how nice it looks. I can't really play the game because I'm holding on to my phone. I just want you guys to see how nice the graphics look on this thing. The graphics are incredible. Very nice. The color looks off on the phone. Um, it was showing the red more as orange. On the TV, it's not like that. The uh, colors are 100% accurate. Like, the, they're very accurate colors. It looks a little different on the phone. I don't know why. Um, but um, I, I can assure you, the colors are very accurate on this TV. I've never seen a more color accurate TV before. Like I said, um, I can't really play the game because I'm holding my phone, but I could just, I guess, just walk around and show you how the graphics look. <coughs> I love playing poker on this game. I go to the, uh, the, uh, train station. I can't think of what it's called right now. I think it's Flat, Flat Neck Station. And I play poker there all the time, and I always win. <laughs> I remember when I first started playing this game and I found a station. I was so poor. Um, I instantly got like $50. And then I went back there the next day and I got like $70. And um, I was able to upgrade my camp and unlock everything. Which is important. Um, the first thing you should do in this game, and I really recommend it, is upgrade your camp. Not fully, but um, like unlock the ammo. Unlock the food and unlock the medicine. It's extremely important in this game. I cannot tell you how much it saves me money that I can just go to my camp and I can just go to the medicine station and get the medicine I need and just go to the ammo station and just get the ammo I need and get the food I need without having to pay for it. It's the most important thing to do in the beginning of the game. Um, so... A lot of people don't, they just play the game, they don't do that. It's going to be very hard. I only have one hand. I don't know if I can do this. <laughs> Let me show you what I'm talking about. Okay, I'm actually not doing too bad. This is your ammo station right here. I ha I unlocked this, yes, blah, 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 auto save. So, keep in mind, I'm doing this with one hand, so. Okay, this is all your ammo. I unlocked this. This is very important. Some people don't unlock this in the beginning of the game. They wait. Don't do that. That's stupid. Let me show you the food. This is pretty hard to do with one hand. This little book, actually. Let me show you it. This little book right here is very important. Don't worry about always... Like, make sure you donate the money and then go to contribute. This is very important. Oh, no problem. One. I might say go to Ledger. You know... Go to contribute first, donate your money, and then go to the ledger. This little book's very important. This is what you should do in the beginning of the game. Um, first thing you want to do is upgrade your medicine shop. Fully upgrade your medicine, like I did. Fully upgrade it. 
that's the first thing you want to do okay then you're going to want to save up and fully upgrade your food this is very important for those of you who play Red Dead. I might as well show you this while showing you my TV. Then the next thing you want to do is fully upgrade your ammo. I haven't done that yet, but I'm going to. That's the next thing I'm doing is um, fully upgrade my ammo. Then after that, you're going to want to fully upgrade your lodge. And all that stuff's very important because it gives you the ammo thing I just showed you. And it gives you, let me show you. The next thing it gives you, which is very important, is your health. I know you guys are going to be going to town and you guys are going to be getting into gunfights and stuff. It's just part of the game. <laughs> I know I do it every week. Gives you your medicine right here. Which is extremely important. And then your food. You can pick up all this food over here. So. I can't really play this game right now, unfortunately. Because I'm doing this one-handed. But I'm just going to show you the graphics. Oh my god, look at that. Wow. This is amazing. Look at this view. Wow. The graphics on this TV are amazing. Look at that. That's beautiful. This, this game is absolutely beautiful. Or this TV. <sighs> so. The graphics are unbelievable in this game. So, that's pretty much what I wanted to show you. We show you a uh, 4K YouTube video. Um, give me a minute. <sighs> I gotta sign in, damn it. Alright, I'll show you guys later. I gotta sign into my YouTube app. I haven't done that yet. But yeah, this is my new TV. It's the uh, Samsung Q7F series. It's the QID TV. It's 75 inches. It's a... Uh, it was a $2,800 TV. I got it on sale yesterday at Best Buy for $900. It's a really good deal. It's worth every penny. I have to agree, I didn't pay the $900. Um, I paid, I didn't, you know, because I got my TV, but um, I traded my TV in. But, yep, that's the TV. Thanks for watching.